The first pictures of the upcoming high power connector for PCI 5.0 compatible graphics cards have been pictured by Igor's lab. Designed for next generation graphics cards, schematics of the power connector show that they'll allow up to 600 watts of power to be delivered directly to the GPUs. According to Igor, the existing power delivery systems are becoming obsolete as GPUs become significantly more power hungry. This generation saw the most graphics cards from both Nvidia and AMD feature triple 8 pin connector interfaces, while Nvidia opted for a 12 pin microfit solution for its own Founders Edition variants. Other manufacturers were reluctant to use the new power standard, but the stopgap made them ready for the upcoming PCI Express 12 VHPWR connector. We will be getting PCI Gen 5.0 platforms from Intel next month, and AMD is expected to hop on the bandwagon sometime in 2022. Intel may also launch its Arc lineup on the new PCI Gen 5.0 standard, so this means that we are definitely going to see some PCI 5.0 action in the graphics card segment too. There have been rumors that Nvidia and AMD flagships will offer two to three times the performance increase, but that also means power consumption would have a massive increase too. As such, there would be demand for a new power connector that's where the 12 volt high power connector that is specifically designed in conjunction with PCI 5.0 interfaces comes in. The new standard is said to provide 55 amps of continuous power through a 12 volt rail, which would allot up to 600 watts of power to be delivered directly to the graphics card. The connector has an interesting form factor where it looks like a slightly bigger version of the microfit connector with 12 pins, but then it also has four extra pins on the bottom. It is also has less spacing than the traditional power connectors measuring 3 millimeters versus the 4.2 millimeters. But overall, accommodating 16 pins means that it ends up bigger, but it's one connector to do the job of three 8 pin connectors. You can see that the connector is rated for 600 watts of power delivery and is PCIe Gen 5.0 compatible, but is not designed for legacy PCIe Gen 2 or Gen 3 cards. Video Cards was able to confirm the new PCIe Gen 5.0 connector a few days ago. Also reported that the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3090 Ti might be the first graphics card to make use of it as the green team gets ready for the launch of the Ada Lovelace lineup of GeForce RTX GPUs for late 2022. But what do you think? Are you excited for PCI 5.0? Let us know in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe for more fantastic tech news.